Ella Amethyst. She's your classic rogue. Uh, very strong attack, very weak and squishy otherwise. So the only way to get her right now is to purchase her through the shop. You can do that using scrolls. So if you spend the scrolls, you can purchase her. At the time that I got her, there was a like a half price deal. So that basically for a thousand scrolls you could you could get her. You can continue to get her tokens to build up her star level that way as well. So she's magical, demon, and rogue. Let's take a look at her stats. So first is weak spot. Uh, knowledge of enemies grants enhanced crit. She's got magical, so she takes less damage from magical attacks. And frenzy, increased crit chance. So you can look down at her stats. Again, attacks pretty high. Defense, medium to low. Um, but her health is pretty low as well. And decent skill level. We've got that crit chance that's about doubled there. Um, and a higher crit multiplier. Okay. So her skills, her first skill she starts with is kind of interesting. It's called Charm. It um, it does basically inflicts days um, and then also has a ranged attack but it causes the uh, the enemy that she inflicts it on to attack the other their own team when I've used it so far it seems that it just causes them to attack one time with a normal attack which isn't as interesting as it could be but that's that's the way it's worked out for me uh, I haven't seen any other effects from it. Similarly, when I've had it used on me, uh, especially in the rating. So if we look over at her uh, ascensions, her next ascension is going to give her blood ritual. So she'll be able to sacrifice a little bit of health to heal her ally and boost their attack and critical. And she gets vampiric. But there's a couple things with her. I think, so she's not my ideal character primarily because she's so squishy. But she has a very high attack character but also very easy to kill. And so when she has skills like this where she's going to sacrifice some of her health, it's just going to make her health pool even lower uh, and make it even easier to kill her. I don't see, you know, if she was fast or something, it would be a little bit better. You could make a better case for her in uh, in raiding dungeons but as it is she's I think so squishy she'd be killed really really quickly and you wouldn't want to end up using using those skills too often uh, I don't use her in campaign either I'd say overall especially when you're starting out in the game I wouldn't waste the scrolls on her you can get some really good uh, heroes from the scrolls and tokens to build up your current heroes, but especially early in the game, just use those uh, use those to roll for high, fairly high chances of getting really good heroes. I would hold off until later on to to get her if you end up getting her at all. I don't keep her leveled uh, with the rest of my team either. But she's interesting, maybe kind of fun. I could imagine having some synergies, for example, with this if you can increase the crit for Chief Nub Nub and get him to proc his. Uh, his team heal regularly. That would be excellent. I'm not sure how high this critical percentage would go. If you could just about guarantee it, then that sacrifice of health wouldn't make any difference because she'd get full healed again afterwards. It, it might make for an interesting uh, situation for campaign. But again, it seems like you're sacrificing a lot to get there. Her final skill is not listed here. But, let me look at it real quick. Her final skill is going to be Kiss of Death, which does a melee attack. And if they're, the target's health is less than half, then it gets a multiplier of 2.5, which would be great. I guess especially for bosses, if you're trying to finish off a boss. Uh, but again, taking her... The only bosses that are really difficult are the epic bosses and bringing her to an epic boss seems like sure failure to use all of your revive potions on her. So 
I don't suggest using her early on. It might be interesting as you fill out all your characters, just have another character to play around with. Uh, but for now, I think it's fine to not purchase her. You're not missing out on anything. <laughs> 